12. Well, this heat advisory days, air quality alert days, certainly hard for those that do suffer from respiratory issues. And today's you know, one of those days in this hot and humid air as we look at our hurricane barrier camera in Providence. If you're looking for some relief, it's coming. We've got temperatures today at around 90, but then dropping every day after that from 87 Thursday to temperatures in the middle 80s Friday and by the weekend running in the low 80s. Our temperatures right now though, they're at 90 in Taunton and in Providence, upper 80s in Newport and in New Bedford, Plymouth in the upper 80s. So is Smithfield. It's a hot afternoon and it's also a very humid one, though the highest dew points right now have shifted offshore. We've actually seen our dew points drop into the upper 60s. That's still very hot on a and very humid on a 90 degree day, but we're seeing our winds shifting more to the north and northwest in inland areas, a sign of some less humid air trying to work its way in. So I still think we're going to be seeing that heat index. Those feel like temperatures in the mid and upper 90s for the next several hours of the afternoon. And even this evening, it stays very warm and uncomfortably so. And that's why we're under that heat advisory until 8 o'clock this evening. Nothing popping up on the radar. This is just ground clutter around the radar site. We'll be keeping an eye out over the next couple of hours for some isolated showers and thunderstorms to develop. You can see not everyone sees one. The temperature is still hovering around the upper 80s and low 90s through 5 o'clock in the evening. So keep an eye to the sky, especially just inland. And then as we head into this evening and tonight, most of those showers will be winding down. It's associated with the cool front and that front sitting right over us here in southern New England. To the north of it is where that more refreshing air is. And uh, here where we are in southeastern New England, we're still in the heat and humidity. So that front will continue to slowly work its way southward. Just an isolated shower for those that are spending the afternoon at the beaches and on the bay. Keep an eye out for that shower or thunderstorm winds out of the southwest and west this afternoon about 5 to 10 knots for tonight gradually becoming a little less humid and the temperatures are actually gonna be a little cooler than what we woke up to this morning and that's late at night as those lows fall to around 70. So here's the trouble for your Thursday. It's not a huge issue, but we do have this front and it stalls out just offshore close enough to us to keep some extra clouds around on Thursday and perhaps bring an isolated shower to the area. So that's still in my forecast for Thursday. Most spots are dry. It's still warmer than normal in the upper 80s. Friday's high near 85. How about the weekend forecast? Saturday's in the lower to middle 80s and it comes with comfortable humidity. Nighttime lows falling back into the 60s and on Sunday we may have some spots that don't even hit 80 degrees. Upper 70s, Smithfield and Attleboro, 80 Providence and Taunton and in the upper 70s at our beaches. You get the updated forecast throughout the day today on the WPRI 12 weather app or interactive radar and keep you in the loop with any of those showers that pop up through the day.